Hello friends. Today I'm going to show you how to design a wedding card using MS Word. So, let's begin the design process. Step 1. Create a new document. Step 2. Page Setup. To set up the page, I will go to the Layout tab, then click on Size and choose the A5 page size. You can choose any other page size based on your preference. Next, I will change the page orientation. Click on Orientation and select Landscape. Now, I'll set Custom Margins. Click on Margins, then select Custom Margins. I'm setting the margins to 0.5 cm. You can also choose narrow margins if you prefer. Step 3. Design the background. Now, I will insert a rectangle shape and resize it. Next, I'll change the page background color. If you don't want to change the page color, you can simply insert a rectangle shape and set its fill color to black. After that, I'll insert an image inside the rectangle shape. To properly adjust the image within the shape, I'll use the Crop tool. Then, I'll change the picture border color and increase the border thickness. Now, I will insert a text box and write Wedding Invitation inside it. I'll select a new font, increase the font size, and align the text to center. After that, I'll remove the shape fill and outline of the text box. Then, I'll change the text color. Next, I will insert an oval shape. I'll change its fill color and outline color and increase the outline weight to make it thicker. Then I'll copy this oval shape, resize it, and change its outline thickness. I'll copy this shape again, place it, and increase its size. Now, I'll select both oval shapes and align them. Next, I will insert a heart shape on top of the oval shape. Change the fill color of the heart shape and remove the outline.
Next, I'll select the shapes and align them to center and middle. Next, I'll select the shapes and align them to center and middle. Now I will insert another heart shape. Change its size, fill color, and remove the outline. Now I'll make the shape's fill color transparent. First, I'll select the shape, then right-click and choose Format Shape. I'll increase the transparency to get the desired effect. Next, I'll copy this heart, increase its size, and reduce its transparency. Then I will rotate the shape. Again, I'll copy this shape, reduce its size, and use multiple hearts to create a top decoration. I'll set transparency to 0% for Now I'll select all three heart shapes, distribute them horizontally, and group them. Next, I'll insert a rectangle shape, resize it, and change its fill and outline color. I'll also increase the outline thickness, then copy and place the rectangle. After that, I'll insert a text box and type. Save the date. Then remove its fill and outline.
I'll add another text box with the message. We invite you to celebrate our wedding. I'll change the text color, remove fill, and customize the outline color. Now, I'll insert another text box to write the bride and groom's names. Set a font and size, and remove the box's fill and outline. Next, I'll insert another text box for the wedding date, month, and time. I'll copy this text box and use it to write the wedding location details. Then, I'll select all objects and align them to center. Now I'll insert one last text box to write the first letter of the bride's name. Select a nice font and change the text color. I'll also remove fill and outline. I'll copy this text and write the first letter of the groom's name. These two initials together will form a simple logo type design. Finally, I'll insert an oval shape, change its fill color, remove the outline, and apply a soft edge effect. Then, I'll add a transparency effect to this shape. This is how you can design a complete wedding card in MS Word. Now convert your Word file to PDF and get it printed. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video.